Joe, you're Head of Strategic Technology Innovation at the Home Retail Group. Can you tell me how technology is changing for you? Fundamentally, it's changing every aspect of our business. I think from back-end systems, Argos in particular has lots of legacy systems which need updating, and we've just announced a programme of improvement in that area, right to sort of front of house the technology that customers see when they go into the stores, the technologies that they're using themselves as consumers. I'm talking about mobile technologies and tablet. It's all changing. And, and with a pace that's um, rapid, more rapid than ever before. Well, you're here um, doing a presentation on that very thing for the, the Harvey Nash Technology Server. One of your slides which really fascinates me is a, is a link to a YouTube clip of, of showing the, the Adidas um, kind of interactive wall. Can you just talk, talk me through it? Because it, it was an amazing piece of technology and I'm also wondering what impact it has on retail. Sure, so the, the Adidas, I think it's called the Adiverse wall, and obviously I don't work for Adidas, but it's already on YouTube, So, and I'm a big fan, so yeah, yeah. I want to say that first of all. Um, it, it's some technology that they invested in as a prototype, and essentially it's the endless aisle of shoes that can't make it into the store. So um, it provides a sort of 360-degree view, there's social feeds that come in, uh, 360 surround sound, it's, it's an immersive experience, and it's fantastic I think it's wonderful um, but I was kind of skeptical on the cost side of it and, and recently they've come out and said that all the trials have been in, uh, phenomenally successful so they're rolling it out and I see that sort of technology being um, the way that we move from in-store pods which is kind of very analog printed pods that people perhaps don't see anymore to a sort of immersive experience that can be a bit more personalized where you have digital screens that recognize you as a consumer um, and then provide you with content that's relevant to you as that consumer. I know, I know it all sounds quite minority report, but you only have to look back five years as to what we were doing with, say, mobile phones then, yeah, yeah. to know that looking forward, it can all see, seem quite futuristic until you're there, and then it's all quite normal. Exciting times. Joe, thank you very much. Thank you.